In this video, I want to show you how you can get your immersion heater work to operate when there's a fault on the system. So you can see there's an alarm here, E912, showing. You can also see that the sun symbol has disappeared and the tap symbol has disappeared here. The problem is, if you clear this fault code, it will just come back again. So to get the immersion heater running while we're waiting for the engineer, this is all you need to do. If you press the test button and the blue set button and hold them down, five seconds you'll enter into a service mode and you can see the word test written here. Okay first thing you need to do is start the water pump so press this button here. The water pump must run all the time in test mode so it's running now. We now need to press the weekly button and you'll see a little picture of a tap where the heater comes on. This means your immersion heater is now active. This will stay active until the engineer arrives to fix the problem. So as long as you don't touch anything, everything will be fine. To finish with this mode, all you need to do is press and hold Cancel Delete and you'll return to your normal screen so the engineer can fix the problem. But at least you'll have hot water while you're waiting. I hope that helps.